Okay, so now we are heading back to collect Mama and Papa, <laughs> and then we are going to go continue on to Norway to go use the fast pass that we have because the guy said it was good anytime after 6.02. So, so I think it's past that now, so we'll be able to go ahead and ride Frozen. <laughs> Welcome back to the Odyssey building there. I just kind of had a flashback to Festival of the Arts and how they had the Animation Academy set up in there. I loved that festival so much. I think Festival of the Arts might now be my absolute, hands down, favorite festival of all time. I just love it. I love this one too. I love Flower and Garden, but Festival of the Arts, that was just like my thing. I loved it. I just noticed this here in Norway. I wonder if you could go out on that little balcony. Because I know upstairs they have that one room that you can like run out for different events and such, or they sometimes do the different specialty events up there. I wonder if that's part of it. I'm not sure like where that's located in here. It's time for Frozen. I cannot wait. <laughs> We're going to go head back towards Future World, I think, because we have some fast passes over there for the Seas with Nemo and Friends to now finally ride that because we walked through the exhibits earlier, but we're now going to actually ride the ride. And I think we also have a Spaceship Earth fast pass, which, you know, I love Spaceship Earth. And this time around, we will actually hopefully have audio because if you remember that video from the other night, we didn't have audio, but I personally kind of love that to see it with that perspective because I was able to like try my hand at what I remembered. <laughs> I was having a good old time with that, like seeing the behind the scenes of it. Shout out to cast members. Cast members are amazing. My pop-up lost his Phillies hat on the ride. 
and they were able to go in there and find it like instantly that was so cool all right so now we are going to go i think i want to stop by before we head into future world and get the desert violet lemonade and this year they have a super cute photo op for the desert violet lemonade that it's so cute Alyssa got a picture with it the other day and she was showing me it is like the cutest setup they're like really like desert violet lemonade has blown up they've got merchandise for it they now have these photo ops for it it's really cute you can get the desert violet lemonade from the pineapple promenade. Yeah, they also have the Dole Whip here. It's called pineapple soft serve, but it's basically it's the Dole. Whip. It's the um, it's frozen. It's like a slushy. Yeah, it's violet lemonade. It's really good. Oh, they also have the Dole Whip with a Fanta. I want the violet lemonade though. That's the festival classic. Look at the Disney ducky. <laughs> Look at this right now with like the golden hour, the sun hitting Spaceship Earth. Hi, baby! <laughs> You're so cute! Hey! Thank you. Oh, look how cute! I love the flowers. <laughs> That's awesome. There she is! So here's the setup that they have for it. This put a little zest in your fest. So I just did a little photo shoot and I realized I have my purple magic band on today too, which is perfect for this. This is so good. And my dad, dad, what'd you get? You have the, was that the one with the Fanta or it's just the regular Dole Whip? No, just the regular Dole Whip. Dole Whip, the pineapple, pineapple soft work. Very good, soft serve. very refreshing. Yay! Yeah, so I am having, this is the Desert Violet Lemonade and they didn't have straws up there this year. Disney's like really cutting back on the straws, but it's good to just eat with a spoon. And then I'm actually, once it starts to get a little bit melty, you can just go ahead and drink it like that. Okay, so I ran down and got us a return time for Soren. We can do that at 8.11, they said. But right now we have a fast pass for the seas with Nemo and friends, which will be exciting because we Yay. walked through the seas earlier, but now we can actually ride on the ride of the seas. And we were cracking up because when you're like in the aquarium part is where the ride exits. And they have a sign there now that says, this is not how you get on the ride because at that point the cars are empty. And yeah, so we were yeah, like, sure how many <laughs> times have people like tried to sneak in <laughs> that way and just ride around? So, yeah. oh yeah. So we'll probably like just walk right on with this one. Yay! Oh, and I love the mine, mine, mine birds. The mine, mine, mine. Hi, Dad. <laughs> Dad. He's not. Hello. <laughs> There's one and pop up. Here we go, Mom. Yeah. Our clam show. Under the sea. Under the sea. Oh, don't worry. Just keep your eyes open for along the way. Yeah, Mom. Now, now, great. Oh, let's go explore, explore, explore. Let's go explore the big blue world. swims there, Mom. We always love this, how he goes through the one end of the pipe and out the other. Nemo! Oh, what there he is! Yay, <laughs> <laughs>
pretty it is. And the moon is out, but it's still like light out. It's beautiful, beautiful evening. Here comes a monorail. Oh yeah, this is a good picture. When the approaches. Look. to the land. I just realized this will be our second time on Soren for the day. I actually don't know if I've ever done that before. Have we ever done that? Like Soren twice in the same day. So. This is the first. Oh, this is so exciting. experience the other night like riding it with no audio whatsoever I mean I would imagine if we have Sam we're like if it was your first time riding it you would be so confused like what is this what is happening right now but having seen it many times it was kind of interesting because we got to then hear like the um, animatronics because they do like make little like small talk background noise so without the ride audio you were able to hear that stuff going on it was interesting so yeah, I'll put a link to that video if you haven't seen that one. But we're gonna go ride it and see if all those kinks are sorted out. <laughs> mm -hmm. Look at this view right now with the moon. Is it a full moon tonight? Or it's like almost full, it looks like. So pretty. Yeah. So they actually have fast pass shut down because there's nobody here. <laughs> so we could just walk right up. Are you filming? Um, anybody. Hi, mom and dad. Hi. Hi, dad. <laughs> Hi. Hello. <laughs> Okay, so so far it seems like the screen is lit up, so I think it's working. We'll see if it asks us where we're from, because it didn't do that last time. Let's see. I don't know, it's not asking us anything yet. Oh! Here we go. The voice sounds different for some reason. I always say I'm from Florida, because one day soon I will be. Audio is working. Unfortunately, taxes. But it also brings with it the dawn of dreams. 
Part. I love these stars and when you like dip down past that last room and then you come in with all the stars. I love this. Let's have some fun creating oh, the future, shall we? Let's! Okay, what should we do? On your computer screen, answer a few questions for us. Then we'll show you a new world, custom made just for you. Okay, I'm going to do Ready? home. latest technology for something different. Where would you like to live? Ah. City. Mm, I need to become a better cook. <laughs> Which is the hardest? Um, what to wear every day. I can buy stuff all day long. <laughs> I like to start um, watching TV. Car that drives itself. Well done. Now along with your answers, let's add in some amazing new technology that we happen to know about. Where it's just about ready. Let's take a look, shall we? Welcome to the future. Or should I say, <laughs> your future. There's my little friend. 
and Chef would be a thing. Waiting for us to go wee. There. Oh, there you go. We didn't wee yet. There you go. There you go. <laughs> they have all these different games and stuff set up. My dad's doing this driving thing. We said we want to start doing all the different experiences that they have in here. We did that medical thing the other time. What? Is it like a futuristic -y car or just like a regular car? Tomorrowland or something. and do these things but it was like maybe was that back in February or maybe maybe November that I one of the times that we were here recently we did that one that was like the skeleton and you're like putting those bones in the thing and we were like we need to like appreciate all these just different things that you can do like there's a bunch of different things different games and like interactive stuff because when they do like the whole renovation in here like who knows like this all might be changed so we gotta experience all this different stuff and then here is just as you come out of Project Tomorrow from Spaceship Earth. Here's the bubblegum wall. No, that's the other. Okay, we're actually, we're hanging out here. We just came off of the escalator of the Lime Garage and we're right by Polite Pig. And I think I mentioned the other night, my mom has heard that they have like the best chocolate chip cookie in the entire world here. It is so cute. Oh, which one? The, oh, I'm here for the food. <laughs> that is precious. These glitter bags. Oh wait, this was the shirt that I said I need. That's, I'm here for the photos. The yeah. This is what I need. Oh gosh. <laughs> Look at that, it's a green army man. 